Hi, my friends. It's Jovi. I'm outside. I just had my lunch. It's freezing here. It's very cold. And uh, I just had my lunch, which was prepared by my husband yesterday. And uh, yes, uh, for those who don't know, uh, my husband and I'm a very lucky one. My husband is a professional cook. So since he is here in Switzerland for the next couple of days, uh, he's spoiling me a lot. So he, he cooks for me and he prepared my lunch for today. So it was a healthy one and uh, you may know we are looking uh, very straight to our um, nutrition. I'm a TCN therapist so it's very important for me or should be for everyone what you eat. So um, yes, I in uh, 20 minutes I have to go back to work. So I just wanted to share that with you, that uh, I just had such a, a bad start at work. My boss is really, I don't know, I don't know <laughs> what person she is, but she's never content. She always complains, she always looks for mistakes and most of the time it's not even my mistakes but something she did but uh, anyway i just want to tell you that is so a loss of energy when you work for someone who <coughs> doesn't care for you or not interested in you are just never content uh, whatever you do it's nothing and uh, nothing is good enough you know I, I i mean could you imagine you take this energy and do something for yourself <laughs> i mean you could move mountains and i just want to tell you i'm just going to do that i mean i have so many I have so many dreams, I mean, I have already accomplished so many things. My boss didn't e even, he didn't know about, uh, d she d doesn't know anything about me. She doesn't know that I and my husband built a guest house in South Italy from scratch. It's it's not like just a, a little house, It's it's like a villa. She didn't she doesn't know that and she don't have to know that because I don't want to share that with her I just want to share that with people who who like me who trust me who my friends you know my friends and I just wanted to uh, say that I can't wait and I can't wait to 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 leave that that job I tell you uh, if I uh, would have to stay longer there I probably would get sick and I'm sure many many people are in this uh, situation that they just go and they just surviving at their job but they don't like the job like it's for me it's just something uh, for me it's just something which allows me to exist but it's not my dream I have this for, uh, as a security and I'm going to build up to that I will have my guest house working hopefully this year and summer I have my 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 practice my um, Chinese medicine practice which I love doing I love health uh, it's really my passion to look after people and to get them um, fit again with their help of course but I just I just wanted to tell you that I'm in this industry in this online uh, marketing industry for over a year now and I really rely on that that I will be successful in that I will put everything I can into that the time I have to put in because I'm doing so many things around this online business but uh, I will do my best uh, to really accomplish things. I already 
I already have、uh, some results, you know, and that's what keep on keeping on. Like Dave Renica says, that's my mentor, and I really look forward to make this work. And I can wait the day I can go to her and say bye bye. Ciao, have a nice life. I will have my nice life. So I can't, I can't wait. So I just wanted to tell you: if you have a dream, just you need a job because you have to survive. You, you, you need it that is a security. But if you have something in mind, you have a passion, you have, you have something you you wanna go after that, something you love doing. So. Oh, don't lo- don't waste your time. Just just go for it because from a passion for something you love, out of that you can make you you can really make a a profession. <laughs> you can you can help people. You can、um, provide services. Um, and I mean with something you love doing. So that's a huge 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 difference. To that, what I'm doing now, I have to do it because I need the money to survive. Until my other jobs work well, so that I can put、uh, away this one, I can quit this one. I can't wait to do that. I tell you. <laughs> so I just wanted, I just wanted to share that with you. I'm freezing out here. I have to go somewhere and have an espresso <laughs> to warm me up. And、uh, before I go back to work, and、uh, just, just don't waste your time doing something you don't love to do, doing something you hate. Don't waste your time. You you have so much capacity.、Um, use it. Use it. Go ahead and be creative. Use your capacity, your power, your your resources.、Um, do everything it takes, but. Just go after something you love doing and yeah, you like doing. Okay, just wanted to share that with you. I wish you, from the bottom of my heart, I wish you a happy, happy life, and <coughs> really a, a, a great, great start into this new year. This will be the year two thousand and seventeen. Actually, I was born on on the seventeenth. Just my 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 parents, they、uh, registered me on the eighteenth because for them the seventeenth it it's an unlucky, it's an unlucky day like、uh, Friday the thirteenth. Actually, it was、uh, <laughs> my birthday was on a Friday the seventeenth. That's why they changed my birthday to the. Eighteen instead of the seventeen. Just wanted to tell you that seven and seventeen is my lucky day. So this will my lucky year. I hope the same for you, and I wish you a really happy life and a beautiful, a little bit warmer day maybe. <laughs> okay, thank you so so much. Bye bye. Thank you. Bye bye.